Hello guys, what is up? It's Mace. Oh, welcome back to Blazed and Glazed. Um, I don't, you know, always look like this, but sometimes I do. Sometimes I do, especially in the morning, because we need a good ass cold ass sheet mask upon our face. Welcome to a new video. We're gonna be talking a lot about fall fashion. Um, and I'm just gonna be taking you like around in my life the next like two days. I wanna show you guys some thrift finds that I picked up recently and do a little haul for you, stuff that I just like literally need to show you guys because it is so sexy and fabulous. I can't even take myself seriously we with this. We will have to commence when this is done. Okay, I'm back and I have brought my ice ball that I am going to slap upon my face. This is one of my favorite things to do, just like a hot tip for you guys that also get migraines. I love doing this. Obviously ice like depuffs your face, but it also just makes it feel so good. And I like to do it over a sheet mask and not like directly on my skin. I'll do it on like my neck skin because it really does feel good on the back of the neck if you have a migraine. By the way, these are just like whiskey ice molds that my friend got me literally from bloomingdale's for my birthday so i think you can really just get ice molds anywhere this one's really dull right now obviously but oh my god it just feels insane it just feels insane like i said we're gonna do a lot of fall fashion in this video i hope my face is super red That's reminding me of that, like, Pedro Pascal, like, um, this. I'm just gonna sit here and say I love you and say hi and slay and yas. And yas. I just, like, love him. He's so sexy. Okay, I'm gonna finish up my skincare routine here and then we're gonna head downtown to my friend's studio because I need to work on some photos and content for my next whatnot, like, live clothing sale that I'm doing. We're gonna talk more on that in a minute. But yeah, I need to finish that this morning because my sister's coming to visit this week. I have so much going on this week and I'm gonna take you guys on a couple days with me. So I have a very fire thrift haul for when we get home. I will be showing you cute things. And I think I'm gonna also, like, break down kind of like my inspo for you guys in this video because a lot of you guys have asked like how I kind of like break down like my Pinterest inspo and like my album inspo photos on my phone and stuff that I take to the thrift that help me thrift manifest so we're gonna do all that in this video but first we gotta go downtown zoom zoom okay so we've made it downtown we've made it to Meta I'm here with little Freddie Bean and I'm going through all the stuff that's gonna be in the new whatnot sale I've already photographed all of this stuff I'm just like hanging things up on the wall here this is like a really fun ruffly skirt and we're just vibing out so today's video is sponsored by whatnot and you guys know that i've been working with whatnot over the past two months now this is the third video that i'm doing with them the third live that i'm doing with them actually i guess it's the fourth i did like a random live if you guys caught it like two weeks ago that wasn't even like part of the sponsorship that we've been doing i just love using that app so much and like talking to you guys on it and getting rid of stuff and i am at my friend amy's studio downtown you guys know amy and we did like an in-person pop-up closet sale here with a couple of girls a couple weeks back and we have some overflow left over from that sale plus I have picked up and kind of like pulled more out of my closet for you guys that's more like fall winter vibes for this October sale so if you guys are new to my videos and have not been introduced to whatnot yet it is like a live streaming auction kind of platform where you can resell your clothes but do it in a more like fun interactive way I have been obsessed with using it so far just because I'm so used to like connecting with you guys and talking with you guys through my videos it feels so much more natural this is what happens when you film downtown okay thank you sir anyway like i was saying it just feels so natural for me to like be on whatnot and kind of like sell my clothes and when i clean out my closet sell my clothes to you guys in like a live stream format because it's so much more fun and so much more me and just like posting pictures on a platform so my next whatnot show is going to be this week this thursday at 4 p.m pst i will have the link down below that you guys can click and if it's your first time using whatnot you can follow my page through that link and get ten dollars to spend on the stream so i'm very excited for this one i have some really really sexy and fabulous fall pieces and I've actually styled a quite a few of the pieces that I'm going to be selling in this stream to you guys into some fall winter kind of transitional looks for you guys so let's cue that little fabulous try on extravaganza what is it a lookbook what is this 2014 enjoy okay this was going to be an outfit montage but I realized that literally all of the bottoms I'm getting rid of like most of them don't fit me so I'm just gonna show you guys the bottoms right now real quick I'm gonna have these like amazing camo pants I have this really great like cream little skirt moment that has like pleats in the back really really cute this gap skirt it kind of has like a really cute 
cargo vibe to it. We have this little baby, literally gorgeous. I wish this was my size, but alas, it is not. Okay, this set that I thrifted the other day, I could not leave it behind. First of all, it's like a cardigan and a long dress, and it kind of reminds me of like House of Sunny vibes. Look at the tag, and it's like this amazing cardigan with just like a long tank maxi dress, and I think it's a size... Oh my god, this is so old, guys. It has, like, the paper tag. It's a size extra large. And, oh my god, I just, like, cannot wait for whoever gets this. I have another, like, on the prairie. But this is more, like, a light wood fairy vibe. <laughs> versus, you know, like, our witch fairy prairie vibe from before. I love this. This is also a size extra large. So, I got you guys. This cutie little halter dress right here. I love this. I just have, like, so many that are similar to this kind of, like... Brittany Murphy, Uptown Girls, 2005 you know, kind of vibe. I also am gonna have some accessories, like some jackets and purses, but this one specifically, this Marc Jacobs bag, oh my God, I love it so much. This and everything else on the stream, I don't know if I said, is gonna be starting for just $1. Literally every time I do a sale on whatnot, every single item starts at $1, and then the bidding just goes up from there. But sometimes stuff really does like end up going for like just a couple of bucks, so. That's it. Okay, back to the video. So I'm going to finish shooting all of the clothes. I've been like kind of using Amy's like big white wall right here just to get some really good product shots of everything so you guys can get like a really good close-ups of what the items look like. And then, I don't know, Tyler and Freddie are here with me right now helping me. Hello. Freddie's sleeping. Freddie's sleeping. Do you guys want to see him? Of course you want to see him. Oh. Unify. Amy and her boyfriend Davy, who she has this studio with, are in Italy actually right now and they let me come film. So this has been very good to kind of get out of the house and get out of my, you know, my filming zone and film somewhere else. My filming setup is just so cluttered because obviously there's clothes everywhere. Here they have just like such a serene vibe. Guys, I can't get over this Mickey sweater. Tyler and I found this at an estate sale recently and we had to get it for the whatnot. It was like a golfing focused estate sale, I guess you could say. What you say was like golfing focused. I'd say the estate sale itself was golfing. But like the person was a golfing. Yeah. Golf apparel and like accoutrements. Accoutrements. <laughs> too funny. Too funny. Okay, this is what I'm looking at, guys. I need to pick all of this up because I've been photographing it. Oh, and before I forget, I want to tell you guys that I am doing, I think, two giveaways in this live, and it's going to be for charity. Every single live that I've done so far with Whatnot has been for charity. All of the profits from the sale go to charity. The first one went to Shirley from Beauty to the Streets, and the second one that we did went to Freddie's Rescue, and we literally raised $1,300 for his rescue, so that was very exciting. I haven't chosen exactly what organization is going to get the profits from this live, but I will tell you guys on my Instagram, at Macy Eleni, before it happens on Thursday. So let's get back into photo, 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 pose, vogue, yes, except it's just the clothes. Okay, see you later, skaters. Okay, we're rolling out back home. Got my little boy back there. Oh. What are we going to eat, fellas? You're going to eat my dust. Burn, sassy. Topo Chico makes him sassy. Like, what is going on? What is going on in the House of Commerce? What is going on in the House of Freddy? Boots house down, Freddy. Hey. Freddy Cam. Freddy Cam. Freddy Cam. What is Daddy doing over there? You're looking for a sucker, you found a bunch back there. Like I said, Amy and Davey are in Italy and Tyler's raiding the lollipops. Ah, oh, lollipop. <laughs> you just wanted a specific flame. Say bye guys. See you at home. <laughs> We're going to dinner. Lights, camera, action. We're going to dinner. I'm having a kin. Cheers. Cheers. 
Cheers. Milk. He's having some chocolate milk. <laughs> oh my god, Freddie! Ty, I was gonna say Freddie looks cute. Tyler looks so cute in his vintage sweater. Yeah, I'm a cowboy. And like I said, we're going to dinner. We are driving over to Beverly Hills. Honestly, like right where we used to live, and we are going to have dinner with two very important Ooh, guests. We need guests. Secret guests. <sighs> okay. Freddie, are you so excited to meet tonight's special dinner guests? <laughs> Guys, I'm so excited. I'm literally just wearing this off the shoulder sweatshirt and jeans, and like I said, I'm having a kin. Miss Bella, please send me these. They're expensive. He gets so sad when Tyler's pumping gas. He's coming back. He's coming back. Positive things, but then also like shit talking. Well, like and like the, the real shit, and like trauma. Episode. Yeah. And like all the things. Yeah, all the, all the trauma. <laughs> Guys, I told them I was having dinner with a treat. Oh, hello everybody. A snack, I guess you should say. It feels good to be And then look who's here. Look who she got to meet. Um, and he got to meet Layla. Oh, yeah, um, Freddie and Layla did have a meet and greet, and Layla like kind of tried to like to. Like, she was like really excited, the ghetto, like, and he was like, "Okay, chill." Like, she was just she was like excited to have a friend. She was excited to have a friend and was like, "Oh my god, you're a dog! I'm a dog!" And Freddie was like, "I'm going under Carrie's bed right yeah. now and like running away." He was like, "Bye." But we're here having a quad date. They're on a date, and we're on. A yeah, they're on a date. <laughs> And then we're a triad. Yeah, I just love that. Really like yeah. Feels so good to be back. I mean, just us. I feel like that. Tiny pumpkin. Okay, I just got to the talks. Let's go get the literal shit squeezed out of me. Good morning, guys. Good morning. I am just in a chipper ass mood today. I had such a fun time at dinner with Carrie and Drew last night. Freddie had a blast too. It was honestly just the best. It is super early in the morning and I owe you guys a little fashion thrift fall convo, if you will. I have been utilizing like my inspo boards when thrifting so much more lately, like more now than I ever have in my life. And I think it's one really, really helpful for obviously like thrift manifestation, thrift manifesting, if you will, really having like the items and the styles and the colors and the silhouettes that you're looking for, the brands that you're looking for in your mind. I really do think that like helps like gravitate the things towards you in the thrift store. I think, you know, it helps to tell the thrift gods what you're after, what your wish list is. And I usually compile that list on my Pinterest. I usually keep like seasonal Pinterest boards for like what I'm trying to thrift for each season. And then I also have like a privated thrift manifest board, which is like less vibes and outfits and more like specific items that I'm looking for. And then I also, on the other hand, take a lot of like screenshots of people's Instagram stories and, you know, screenshots and photos of movies and TV shows that I'm watching or just literally like a sign I'll see outside or like someone's outfit that I'll see outside, sneaky sneaky. And I will put it all into like a thrift inspo like album on my phone. So even if you don't use Pinterest, I really like to utilize making albums within like, you know, like the actual photo thing app on your phone and do it that way. You can kind of curate a board that way that's just like private for you on your phone. And I have quite a few pieces that I've picked up recently. I know I haven't really been bringing you guys with me to the thrift store in a ton of videos. I will start doing that again more if you guys want. Obviously you can find me all the time on TikTok and on shorts and on reels on Instagram, like making thrift with me 24 seven but I just haven't done like a long format one in a long time. So let me know if you guys would wanna see one. My sister gets into town tomorrow and we'll do like a big sister thrift day because you guys usually like our videos together. Anyway, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you guys the items and then with each item, I'm gonna pop up like inspo photos that kind of guided me to finding these pieces, if that makes sense. So the first two pieces that I have actually are these like DKNY quarter zips and I'm so obsessed with these. First of all, I thrifted this orange one and then I thrifted this navy one the next week and I about shut my pants, lost my mind, titties were flying, I was so excited. Oh my god, I hear puppy feet on the ground. Hi, Fru. This orange one, I literally audibly gasped from the Goodwill when I found it, and I've been so into these kind of like sporty spice looking jackets, you know, like a little like football, a little rugby vibe, if you will. I love these quarter zips. I think they're so hot and fabulous. Love, love, love. Literally can't stop wearing that orange one in particular. Then, and this is like really little, it's like a brown mesh little like bolero top. Wow, ass lighting always, you can count on in my videos. <laughs> Sorry guys. When we move, when we move into a house like in March, things are going to be so much better. Anyway, this little like bolero moment, obviously like ballet core. I love how like everyone's calling everything like core and like 
like vi like everything like has to have a name. No, I went to high school in like the mid 2000s and we didn't like call our vibes anything besides like preppy jock nerd. Like I don't even know. It just is crazy to me that there's so many like facets of aesthetics. Anyway, for my ballet core biatches, this is like a little sheer a little sheer mesh bolero and I'm literally so obsessed with it. So excited to style it. You guys will see me style it on like Instagram and TikTok and stuff. What is next? Oh my God. Okay. This red dress. I've been so into red. So, so into red. This dress is amazing. It literally just says the brand is Glam, which you, we can always count on like a mid 2000s, early 2000s brand tag at the thrift to just be like vibes, glam, yas, princess, ruby Tuesdays, right? I didn't know, ruby, ruby, ruby rocks. Ruby Tuesdays is I believe a restaurant. Anyway, this is just by Glam, simply Glam. And it looks just like a Realization Par dress. Like, look how gorgeous this is. And that's one of those brands I could like never afford back in the day and always wanted to like buy from. But like the dresses, like the real inspo lives at the thrift store. And I just think this is incredible with like boots. <sighs> with boots. Anyway, so good. I also, you know, in the fall and winter, live for a good, like, statement long sleeve, but that can also just be so casual. I thrifted this one recently, and I just love the colors. It's, like, got this, like, gaudy, like, cross on the front, and it's really reminding me of, you know, like, 2010 vibes when we would, like, stud, like, crosses. It was a skincare delivery for mommy. <laughs> uh, when we would like stud like denim shorts and stuff with like hearts on it, like the old wildflower phone cases from back in the day. Like that's what this cross is giving. Literally so cute. I'm obsessed. I love a good long sleeve. Like I just love a good long sleeve. And they're honestly, it can be kind of hard to throw sometimes. I going through like the women's top section is honestly with the dresses, one of the hardest <laughs> sections to go through at the thrift because it's like shit, 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 fire. Shit, 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 shit fire fire like it just depends so it really does take a hunt okay then i wanted to share with you guys crazy three purchases that i made that are so ho 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 merry christmas the vibes i have been wanting for fall and winter i have been trying to thrift like a racer jacket for so long and like i just refuse to buy one for like a super crazy high price obviously i live in la i could go to any flea market any vintage store i wanted to thrift one and you guys that have been thrifting and like after the deals your whole life like you just get it like when you know you can thrift it like i can't let myself spend like over a hundred dollars on something like i just can't i can't and i shan't and i went so you know i went online i typed in like looking for this jacket who did it what a what a what a and I found these three jackets. These jackets, they're all vintage, they're all secondhand, and they were all under like $50 each. Okay, let's start with the first one that I found, this pink one. Like I said, they're all the exact same brand, all the exact same collection. This pink one with the black stripes and then like the heart with the knife going through it on the back. It's insane. It's insane. Like, it's beautiful. It's, it's beautiful, it's insane. It's got like bedazzlements, it's amazing. Okay, I'm saving the best for last, just so you guys know. And then I got this one. Got the yellow interior. It's got like kind of this amazing detailing on the sleeves. And like the back is faded and it's just like sexy. This one fits like tighter than the other one. And then this one is the star of my life, the star of my soul, the star of the universe, this jacket. The star, the star, the star. Raven, like literally wore this in pink on That's So Raven. That's how iconic this is. Like I melt for this jacket into a million pieces, all of these. So obviously these are a massive sleigh and I hope that this is just a reminder to you guys to like hold out for the good finds, for the good deals because they do exist and they are out there. You just gotta do a little searching all over the place, all over the interwebs. Who knows, maybe I'll be like selling one of these on whatnot eventually, not in this drop, but eventually, stay tuned. Do you love them? Spray, say hi. Hi guys! Guys, I feel like I could just make a whole video being like, my name is Freddie, I'm the cutest puppy in the world, and my life is perfect, blah 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 blah. Anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I am so excited for Thursday's Whatnot sale. It's gonna be such a good time. Even if you guys like don't wanna buy anything, don't have any uh, cash to buy anything, don't even worry about it. I'm gonna be doing two giveaways, I'm pretty sure. I did one last time. I think I'm gonna do two this time. So come to the live, hang out. I'll be live for an hour. My sister's gonna be here for the live, which is so exciting because she gets into LA tomorrow. Freddie is chewing on a bone and being so loud, but get down on it. You've been a good boy today. 
I love you guys so much. Don't forget that you are beautiful as being queen no matter what, doing your thing just the way you do. Truly nobody does it like you. Thank you to Whatnot for sponsoring this video. I love you guys so much. I love you guys so much. Shimmies for Whatnot, shimmies for you, shimmies for me, shimmies for Freddie. See you next time. Peace. Peace, love, and shimmies.